I was thinking the reason I came up with this, and uh, Dr. Davis is going to be here in two days and do more on the science. I, uh, Jean Kilborn in Killing Us Softly, which is an excellent video I hope people are familiar with, talks about advertising. Ads sell us more than products. They sell values. They sell images. They sell concepts of love, of sexuality, of success, and most importantly, of normalcy. They tell us who we are and what we should be. And what advertisement is doing by the PR agencies of telecom is creating a culture which they have manufactured. The iPhone 5, loving it is easy. That's why so many people do. And yet what we're not told is um, that this radiation, oh, I can't. OK. It, I got it. Thank you. The, I can't actually see on the screen here what, what it's doing. So this is a cell phone. This is a imaging of the rate of cell phone radiation absorbed into the head of a child. And the colors represent the intensity. And you can see that a phone to the head, and the, the colors are white is the highest intensity in yellow, and then orange to red to purple to blue. We are not told that cell phone radiation is being absorbed into our brains and into our bodies. And yet, and I just, in my foray into the internet, um, was looking at what the government of Korea is doing. They passed a law labeling cell phones. But this is actually a still, yeah, no, I can see that. I just can't see right here. Uh, this is actually a still from a video that the, the uh, radio research agency of, uh, of the government has put out educating people on how to keep the phone away from your head. And you can go online to watch that as well. But yet, oh, in the United States, we're talking about the race to 5G, where all things will be digital. This is about everything that we have now, but much, much more, with a new experimental kind of technology that is going to be uh, moving the information from device to device to antenna. And this is a, a still from the CTIA, the wireless industry, um, when they talk about a race to 5G. We are in a race to 5G. This is something that industry has created, that we are in this, this race. Really, the race is to put as many antennas in neighborhoods as possible, because what industry is saying is that in order to roll out 5G, they will need to have hundreds of thousands of new antennas in neighborhoods. And I have here an example. The first one, the window, is, uh, was sent to me by someone who said, I, look, they just put this in front of my, my uh, living room window in my apartment in California. Is this OK? The second picture is when I went to San Francisco and I looked out my window at the place I was staying and I saw this small cell installation. And the third picture is showing what the bottom can look like with all the, uh, the electrical equipment that goes along with the antenna, which is very unsightly and also has galvanized people is what they look like. However, around the world, Countries and cities um, are taking notice of this. And uh, this is a mayor from a city in Italy. Uh, there are 130 cities now in Italy that have passed HALT 5G resolutions, 130. <laughs> and that is due to the work of people who have been going out there much like um, the folks who are here tonight, raising awareness, educating, having meetings, talking about this issue, and beginning that conversation and calling for a halt until safety is assured. In India, um, there is a, uh, these 
clubs in, in local communities get together and put on these incredible art pieces. This is actually an installation. Um, it took 100 people to make. You can walk inside of it. I have a video of it online. Uh, and it is about 5G and the impact to birds and to wildlife. And these are just stills from this large scale installation, which actually won uh, the, the local, the regional award. And I need to find out if they have gone on to go higher up in terms of what um, their work. But that, you know, art, art is always the answer. So doing art is a way to communicate this issue as well. And this is just a still also from inside. They have all of these circles with the, the bird and 5G representing all of the antennas that are going to be added into a, onto the Earth. However, in the United States, the CDC says, if you are worried about cell phone radiation, follow the tips below. And we have two nice tips. But no one wants to be worried. And um, hence, our government has failed to protect us on this issue.